How you doing? What's your name? Never mind, pull up on me in Atlanta. Who you hear when I'm putting it down? Gonna get excited. She shit your pants, might need to bring a pamper. Cop a ticket, fuck it, cop four more. Bring your grandma with her knees on swole. Chicken at thigh, figure it out. What better I wake it up on my stage, watch it all unfold. Ho, ho. This is my freedom. This is my voice. My piece of freedom. My blind eyed choice. These are my movements, these are my arms, this is my trumpet, these are my drums, 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 drums. Your Princess Silka. And how did I knew? <laughs> how did I knew? Look, like I said in the previous video, I can't hear myself when I sing it because I have the headphones on and I listen to the original. Yeah, this time I did it, other times I is just sing it a cappella. Meaning, I listen to the phrase, then I stop, then I go to a different app, then I open the document menu of the movie, yes, and then I click on record, and then it does this dig, dig, dig. It brings me totally out of harmony and of rhythm, and I keep that in my head, what I have to do, and then I start singing. And nothing. I just do it like in the air. Yeah, because I cannot really do listen to the movie on my iMovie and record at the same time. And most of the things I've been doing like that. And this time I listened to it on the iPad as I recorded on my iPhone. And I also had a version of the same movie on my iPhone. And then I intended, well, I equalized, I, lev I leveled the, the voice, I paired the voice, my voice, with the original. Yeah, they're two t completed independent things, I could put them out as independent too, and have to put them together. Now, as I, as I sing with my headphones on, listening to my iPad, I cannot hear my voice. Yeah, if I take my headphone out, then I hear my voice, but I don't hear the original. So harmony is what music is about. Yeah, maybe you call it vibing. I'm vibing on the same level. That is what music is about. It is not about doing all the acrobacies, yeah, las marometas, what I'm doing here. This is really not what music is about. I'm absolutely improvising and I'm totally strapped off any tools which are useful to me to do it right. So as I sing, the song is very difficult because it is in a place in my voice where there is, well, it doesn't really matter how you call it. It doesn't really matter that you know it. But there is parts which are more difficult for certain singers than other parts. And then there is other things going on. Like when the voice goes down, you have to have extremely care, extreme care, that you are in tune. Of course, so you know it as a singer and you listen to it, but I cannot listen to myself. So the first time I did the same, I just did it recorded. I don't know, maybe just once. And the one recording I did, I had to put out there 
and it's great. It's a beautiful recording. Yet, there's a tiny speck I am not happy with, so I wanted to do it again and I wasn't allowed. And I had to wait all this time. How many months now? And today, through one of those profiles, the Ave Maria guy, I was made aware that now I can finally do it. I just, let, I just heard it, and he had a tiny speck which wasn't right. And that was my cue. I can finally do it. Yes, we are not into downsizing. Now, I was given that tiny, it was beautiful, but it was a speck which wasn't right. Yeah, pretty much in the beginning. Yeah, yeah no, I'm not to criticize. And this person knows it. I would not write down, it's wrong, if I didn't have to, and that I don't have to, because he knows it. That wasn't the idea. The idea was, I'm giving you the cue. Nobody hears it, I, I can't believe it. Nobody hears it out of, right. Yeah, I believe it, <laughs> but I do. And that's enough for me to know, it has to be perfect. So that was my cue, I could do it, and I could physically actually do it, because often, not even that I can do. No, I am, I am perfectly happy to finally being allowed. Now I look up where I still have it, just to delete every other version I had. Yeah, I'm, I'm, at first, in every public, I wanted to delete them. No, and then I looked, oh my god, delete it. I am showing you how to improvise with the little tools you have and do anything you can. And that is how you improvise, how you approach things. I do not give you out a perfect thing. I need a studio for that. I need reverb. I need a lot of things. I need headphones where I can listen to my own voice when I sing and to the harmonies. Yeah, and it doesn't matter which type, but any type of harmonies. That's what I do need to do it perfect. And then there's a lot of technical things which are put in, which maybe you haven't noticed. Yeah, anything I ever do is I improvise with the little tools I have right here and right now. Yes, and I have perfect, perfect, perfect results. Now I'm in super pain as I speak. You can hear it again. My voice starts, stops being that fluent when I'm in pain. And when, I'm in, when I think about the outrage, I'm in pain, my voice stutters too. I mean, don't stutter, but it kind of, you know, it's a little bit chopped off because it's so heavy to push it all forward. I don't need that. I probe it again in the last video. It can go smooth. Now I'm thinking about an idea I had just a moment ago as I was speaking in this very video. What else to give you? I had one of those ideas, which could be useful. Harmonizing. All I intend, all I ever intend is to harmonize. I can tell you this too. Like, I get, I get it. I mean, I say I went through it and I saw this and that. You see, I don't mind. I am cordial. I am cordial. Yes, I, because I am not really polite. Because polite can be like, I pretend I'm friendly, but I lose you for it. Yeah, like sneaky bitch. I'm not that. I'm honestly friendly and when I'm kind of, man, people who are like putting their knife out and the sword in front of me, that is scary. So I may not be, you know, as warm because I feel protective. But if that is a person who is choosing to do these things in her life, if she doesn't attack me, I can even, I'm not vulgar, but I can even albodear con her, with her. I can even talk. It doesn't mean that I approve of her habits, as long as she doesn't attack me. You see how, like, Jesus gives you chances? Yeah, because I don't know how to say it. I know it's not good and it's not right because it doesn't make her or anybody else feel right. But I am not here with the eye of the... Let's say I do assess. Yeah, I do disqualify anybody who attacks me. That's all, that's for sure. You attack me, you're off. Yeah, no, she said so for another year, <clears throat> but she's off. And she's just gonna pay for it. Every single action she takes, she's gonna pay for it. Yeah, why does she not turn around? I don't understand. I'm Gefahr on the same street. Now, if, now, these people, they're like danger to the, they had shitload danger. I mean, I put, they would put arson in your, in your beverage, if they could, if they had some. That's how dangerous they are. 
but is, if they don't attack me, I can talk to them like anybody else. Why not? And that means they've got a chance. With me, they have the chance to become a totally different person if she wanted to. I don't know if she can. Do you see what I mean? It's individual to individual to individual. What do you want? But are you capable of though? Harmonizing is what I intend. What do I do? I harmonize. And if you're with me, my God, you're gonna feel so amazing. But that's a life choice. That's not just like, okay, I'm gonna throw a diamond here and then I'm gonna go continue doing bullshit. That's not how it works. I love singing and I would spend an amazing amount of time or maybe just five more takes or maybe eight more takes of that song to find my perfect version of it and explore too because I cannot do it because like I said I cannot listen to myself so I wouldn't mind to do three weeks on this take but I don't need three weeks I'd rather do different songs I don't mind to do it again and again because I like what I do when it comes to music I don't lose it at all it takes what it takes remember opera that years years and years to vocalize without being able not allowed able to actually sing a song because this is what it takes I do wish to clarify again not that anybody cares for this but I will clarify it because my ideas are so vast and the words are so little so few of them so i will say it again last night i approached it when you study opera you pass through different stages when you study your voice let's say in order to study opera first you have to make an instrument which applies to even be able allowed to be named opera or operatic voice and that is instead of doing no 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 that's not opera no 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 that's not opera oh baby come on that's not opera that 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 is opera that type of voice it takes like a long time to develop once you have it you can start studying opera and before you can't period but there is a middle stage a stage where opera voices are yeah having beginning to have a little operatic sound that is a very difficult stage because you're like neither there nor are you not there it's like you're on a bridge you can't go back but you can also not move forward unless you're ready and that means you have to continue it will move itself forward that is my point if you continue studying it will move itself forward but in that bridge in the middle and that can take, I don't know, it, it depends on, often singers stay right there, so I criticize them. Yeah, because you don't have support, you have control over your voice. Well, I don't need to be told that, yeah, in the opera workshops it was said, you need to be able to control your voice. Or someone else said it in the, yeah, Michada said it when he talked about Rolando. He got the fortune that he got to know his instrument. Yeah, but for us, this is intuitive. We know that because we know it has to feel right. So we work and we work diligently every time and all the time it takes to get to the point where we get to know our instrument. Before, we cannot just stop and settle. We are perfectionists. So what I'm saying saying is this. Okay, provided you have a good guidance where to direct your voice. And it's actually all on my website. I explained every single step in detail. Yeah, do you know how hard it was to make that happen? Yeah, because I don't know, it's like the program doesn't really like it when I have too many words. The program doesn't really enjoy it. It doesn't want me to add more. I don't know, it gets all weird. But it's okay, I did it, it's right there. But then again, how do you know? So provided you have a good guidance and you continue vocalizing, there is a moment where everybody starts to worry, oh, am I just, is it just me? Maybe it's just I. You're like super worried because you know what you need to achieve, but you can't because you're on that bridge. 
And that is my input from yesterday. Don't you even worry. Just continue vocalizing. Don't you worry. Just don't worry. Because you know how much worrisome that is. <laughs> it's like you want to lift for weightlifters. No, I do not speak weightlifting weights. Uh, okay, let's do it this way. You want to lift a heavyweight weight. Yeah, ex I'm sorry. Excuse me if I do not use the right words. Maybe that's a special word for those heavy things. Too. Yeah, uh, bench. Okay, I learned that too somewhere. So you want to bench heavy weight. But you're like a tiny, you're Mr. Lovely. Lo lover? Lovely? <laughs> Super bad. What was the name again? Super bad. With Seth Rogen, was it? And the other guy, the fatty guy, the slimmy guy. You look like a slim guy. You're not even good for lightweight. And you want to lift heavy weight. You can't. Because you have to adjust your body to it. You have to adjust in opera. It's something. It doesn't matter how it's called. You don't need to know what the theory, where the vocal cords are. And the diaphragm lies. You don't need to know anything. It's totally irrelevant. Or you sing, or you sing. That's also what Tito Capobianco said. Yeah, you can study in high school. You can go to university, whatever you want. But at the end, it comes down to, or you do sing, or you don't sing. Figure it out, what better I figure it out on my stage, watch it all unfold. Ho, ho, 